to you by thesis123.com. I learn and teach online. Here's the next question, number 27. For the circuit shown below, taking the op amp as ideal, the output voltage V out in terms of the input voltages V1, V2, and V3 is. Okay, so we have been given the circuit, the operational amplifier circuit here, with three inputs V1, V2, V3, and we are supposed to find out the output voltage in terms of these three. So, in order to write down the different equations, I have taken this point here and named it as VA. So the first thing we will do is use KCL and write down the volt and write down the equation at this node. So we would have VA minus V1 by 1, VA minus V1 by 1, that's our value. And next would be VA minus V2 by 4, plus VA minus V2 by 4 is equal to 0. So let's simplify this and see what we get. We get 4VA minus 4V1 plus VA minus V2 is equal to 0. That would give us 5VA minus 4V1 minus V2 is equal to 0. Okay. Uh, let's write VA in terms of everything else. So from here we have VA is equal to 4 by 5 V1 plus 1 by 5 V2. So let's keep this equation in mind. We are going to use this for the next, next part of the solution. Okay, so the next thing is to write down the second current equation. Let's take the same point, but this time we will take the point here. So that's VA now. So VA, the second equation would be VA minus V3 by 1. Okay, VA minus V3 by 1. The next thing would be VA minus V out by the resistance in between which is 9. So it's VA minus V out by 9 is equal to 0. If we are to cross multiply and simplify this we will arrive at the equation 10 V A minus 9 V 3 is equal to V out. So in this equation let's substitute V A here. Okay? So when, when we do that we will we'll be writing V A in terms of V 1 and V 2 and we will have the equation for V out in all of these three different voltages. Let me just get another piece of paper, sheet of paper. Okay, here we have. Right, so the equation is 10 VA minus 9 V3 is equal to V out. We have the previous equation for VA. So that would be 10 into 4 by 5 V1 plus 1 by 5 V2 minus 9 V3 is equal to V out. Let's open up the brackets and simplify. Further, we will get 8V1 plus 2V2 minus 9V3 is equal to V out. So this is our voltage equation at the output. Okay, so let's see which part of this it actually matches. It matches number D, option D. So this is our final answer. Thank you for watching this video. For future videos, please click here to subscribe YouTube channel. Visit our site thesis123.com for free student project or research ideas and online training. Follow us Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus and Pinterest.